Hi, my name is Joe Heidler. I'm the owner of Aratech uh, Advanced Rehabilitation Technologies in Ashburn, Virginia. And today I'm going to tell you a little bit about a device that we've been developing for the last five years called Zero G. Zero G originated uh, when I was at the National Rehabilitation Hospital and we identified a need very quickly. Um, we trained a lot of uh, patients with strokes, spinal cord injury, and traumatic brain injury on treadmills with body weight support. Um, and it made a lot of sense because, you know, early in the stages of their injury, they have a lot of weakness, they have coordination issues. And so we really needed to put the weight, uh, give them some body weight support to allow them to actually walk and ambulate. Um, the problem was that these systems were mainly restricted to treadmill based systems. And the problem with that is the treadmill, while it's good for uh, generating lots of volumes of steps and so forth, it doesn't allow patients to practice activities of daily living, such as standing up and sitting, sitting down, uh, walking over distances, maybe navigating a step or two. So we identified early on that this was important. We also know that um, there are two really important factors in the recovery of function after neurological injuries like stroke and spinal cord injury and traumatic brain injury. And those are, we want to try to get patients involved in their therapy very early on after after the injury and intensively and that's a very very difficult thing to do early on because they are weak they have other comorbidities um, and so to try to get them training early after a neurological injury um, uh, intensely is very daunting very challenging for the therapist because of not only safety reasons but also for the therapist and the patient and so we started to develop the system um, in back in 2005 and we've recently uh, commercialized the device and now BioNess is our exclusive worldwide distributor and we have five systems installed and we have uh, numerous other systems that will be installed in the upcoming months and the way the system works um, is it's, it's quite, uh, quite easy to, to demonstrate here. Um, here we have uh, a subject in the system and essentially we put a harness on them and we provide a certain percentage of their body weight support and the body weight support the amount is only the amount needed in order for them to maintain their posture and ambulate and so essentially the harness is, uh, connects uh, they connect to the system through the harness and so right now we have 16 pounds of body weight support to this individual and so as she starts to walk basically the system will walk with her and so it automatically follows her and so it's tracking her intent and if for some reason she were to fall it will catch her and we can set how far we let her fall um, in, in part of the safety safety features and so essentially this allows the people to get up and safely train early after neurological injuries like stroke and traumatic brain injury etc in a very safe controlled manner and as you can see that there's really nobody around her and so maybe if we could have uh, Jody, if you could demonstrate, uh, because there's no um, obstacles around this individual, if Jody wanted to interact with them closely and to help instruct them in terms of how to initiate the movement, how to, how to walk and so forth, um, she can do that. And she doesn't have to worry about the safety of the patient because the system will automatically take care of that. And so here we can really uh, promote patient therapist interaction and that's really very very important to therapists they don't want a device that's basically going to take over and dictate the terms they want to be able to do this put the hands on the patient interact really with the patient um, and and do the things that they want to do and because there's nothing on the ground the system rides on an overhead track as you can see here um, we could basically put down obstacles, we could practice balance tasks, we can do really anything that the type of things that they're going to need to know how to do when they go out, uh, uh, you know, leave the hospital and return to the community. And that might be practicing sitting down and standing up, stepping over some curbs, stepping over obstacles, walking. And we can even uh, put a treadmill underneath one part of the track step up on the treadmill and even do some treadmill training. So really what we're trying to do is promote patient therapist interaction, allow the therapist to do the types of activities that they really want to do um, in a safe controlled manner. So currently Zero G is available in the United States. It's being distributed by BioNess uh, from Valencia, California. We hope to eventually bring it worldwide. Um, so if you'd like more information on the Zero G system and its availability, please contact BioNess. Thanks.